on March 31st, our, our Prime Minister, Mr. Mike Amon, will be presenting TEDx Binnenhof. This day represents a very important day for Aruba because on this day, we will have the unique opportunity to share the vision of our island, not only with the Netherlands, but with the entire world. And on this day, 44 Dutch embassies, together with partners around the world, will be watching TEDx Binnenhof. More than 3,800 viewing parties will be held, and it is exactly for this reason that we are here today. Today is the day that we announce that Aruba is also hosting a viewing event. And that viewing event will take place on March 31st from 9 a.m. to 12 noon. And we will be hosting our TEDx Binnenhof viewing right here at Casti Cultura. For CETER as the number one national telephone company and telecommunications company of Aruba, it's a great pleasure and honor because this is an opportunity not only for our company but for Aruba to shine and give information to the whole world about even we are a small, tiny island in the Caribbean, so many things innovative and in different ways we're looking at the world and to make it a better place. And I think our prime minister will do a great job because um, he is very inspiring. So I hope this event will inspire others, other islands too, and that we will be you know, giving an example for the rest of the world. For me, it's a pleasure and an honor uh, to be here today, but also be able to share some thoughts with you on March 31st on, you know, solutions towards sustainability. My presentation will focus on how small island states, through certain mechanisms, particularly through society and ecological policies and programs, can overcome these uh, environmental ecological challenges that they have in order to improve the sustainability. By this, an invitation to everyone to, uh, to assist and attend, and congratulations to Aruba, obviously, for achieving this great milestone. How we want to see uh, Aruba Island Nations is based on from the, from the inside out. So first, um, we access, assess what we have. From there on, we build houses, we build uh, uh, greeneries, and, uh, and all together we, um, we bonded with education. And the strongest one is art. So art would be the, the glue between all those uh, facets, facets. And I guess um, uh, what we all always, when we, when we see the old houses, the Aruban houses, and we see the new houses, there's always this um, question of why don't we make it like you used to? Yes. Thick walls, um, we uh, use local materials. So that's, that, that's gonna be one of our main uh, uh, objectives, how to build with solely, purely, local materials, no import. 